it's me again and today I'm going to make a video about how it is to spend the pre-Christmas period a, a time that's pretty important in the German culture far away from home in another country I will use this to tell you something about Korean Christmas habits as well as about German Christmas habits since I had pretty many Korean people watching my last video and I thought you guys may be interested in this as well. Also, it maybe makes it a little bit easier for you to understand my situation here. Back then, when I was still in Germany, there were not many things I would have been worried about, like getting too homesick or not getting around alone or anything. The only thing that kind of worried me was the Christmas time. Because in Germany, you have to know, Christmas is one of the biggest holidays we have at all, and especially it's a time you spend with your family. And in, Chris in Korea, Christmas is more like Valentine's Day. And on Christmas Day, you don't spend it with your family and it doesn't really have this Christian background like we do. Um, it's more about spending it with your partner or dating and it's a very romantic atmosphere and it's very commercial. And um, But it's not like our Christmas. And I knew this before, so I was kind of worried that I would really, really miss this. I know today is the 1st of December, so it's a little bit early to talk about this maybe, but actually, here in Seoul, already two or three weeks ago, everything started being extremely shiny, Christmas carols, you can buy Christmas cards. Um, so I kind of already got in this atmosphere, <laughs> and also this week, I got a lot of packages from home, three, and in these packages, there were some really nice Christmas surprises. Not only like the special traditional German Christmas candies or bakery. Like this is Lebkuchen. I don't know if you know that. My mom sent it. I really like these. And you cannot get them here at all. Um, Spekulatius. That's some kind of cookie. You usually drink it with tea. And this is the classic. These are also Lebkuchen, but it's really sweet and really delicious, and I really love it. And um, also, <laughs> she sent me that card. Like, with this, I can make my own, own Christmas dinner. <laughs> and the really, like, the coolest thing she sent me, and I love her for that, I didn't know that, that was a huge surprise, was this. So now I even have my own Christmas tree here in Korea. And actually, like one time, I remember last Christmas saying in Germany, oh, next year I won't have a Christmas tree. But in our lobby, which is kind of my living room, <laughs> um, we have four huge Christmas trees, which are actually fake, but they look pretty good, with a lot of bling bling and lights and I pull our bears. <laughs> yeah, I will take a picture of that later. And yeah, this is my Christmas tree. And then the second package I got from my cousins. And I didn't even know they were sending me one. And here, cousins. Thank you so much for that. They were so cute. They, they even drew something for me. Yeah, but in this package, there was first this thing. I don't know if you know that, but in Germany we have a tradition, especially for kids that every day from the 1st of December until the 24th of December we open one door on our advance calendar. Um, this one has 24 candies in it, like usually there are candies inside these calendars, so every day I can open one. <laughs> um, I think this tradition is to make you more and more and more excited to the Christmas day. And like this pre-Christmas time with this tradition, you, you don't have these traditions here. And so that was really, really cute. And also, it's habit in Germany that um, you put up the scenery like of the holy night, like with the, the crib and the, the Jesus baby and Maria and Joseph and everything. And um, usually we have this really nice in our dining room in Germany. This year I wouldn't have had it if my cousins wouldn't have sent me this. <laughs> uh, like it's a mini version of it but it's really cute isn't it and it's 
like my room is not that big so so it's, it fits pretty good um, and the third thing and this was that really made me laugh and this is really awesome um, we have a tradition in Germany the four Sundays before the Christmas day the four advents every uh, like we have a, a ring of plants and there are four candles in it and every Sunday we light up one of the candles this is also one of the traditions that should make you more excited and now it, like first I only saw this little box this little box and I didn't really know what it was and there were four holes inside then inside there was this and I opened it and there were four tiny candles inside <laughs> so now I even have this advanced ring I don't know how it's called in English but it's really cool that I have it <laughs> so nothing's missing like Christmas can come mm, on Christmas here in Korea I will spend it with friends um, one of them is German one of them is she's pro I, I'm not sure if she comes yet but she's Korean and she speaks German two others are Korean but lived in Germany and like everyone speaks German so we will celebrate some sort of German Christmas and we will go to church together and then we will go grocery shopping and then we will make our own Christmas meal and I'm pretty excited for that I think this is going to be a good Christmas even though I'm far away from home mm. yeah that's it nearly that like, one thing's left today like I, I thought it were just cookies but today I opened it and it were self-made mom's self-made cookies oh. they're really yummy and I'm really excited for that well because every Christmas I'm waiting for these so this like, I have them okay this is it from Hannah in Christmas mood for today I will talk about this later again maybe I think when when we when we have our Christmas Eve I will make a video with them together for you guys have a nice day and have you have a nice pre-Christmas time at home or wherever you are in the world. Enjoy it. Enjoy the Christmas of another culture. And even though it's different, it's really interesting. And just enjoy it.